Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today's video is going to be a um, nursery plant shop with me. Come on, Mama. this is my daughter. Um, it's going to be a nursery plant shop with me. I normally shop for plants or I have this far at the big box store. So Home Depot, Lowe's, things like that. Um, as I've gotten more into house plants and I've accumulated more, I've wanted to sit up. You want to come over here? Sit here. You got to be quiet so mommy can do it. These are my kids. Say hi. 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 Okay. So. Normally, we go to the big box stores like Home Depot, Lowe's, um, you know, to get plants. And normally, we just pick the plants based on which ones we like, right? We usually pick the plants based on which ones we like, right? Like if we like how they look? Yep. Right? Okay. If they don't, if, if, one, if the one plant you get that doesn't, I got to tell you, I got to tell something to the kids. It's if there are kids watching. <laughs> as we get the plants. Mom just wants her plants mm -hmm. going being dead or something. Yeah. Going, to be dead, mm -hmm. going to be dead. So we she should get a not dying plant. That right. that right. that right. needs a lot of shine and die, die, stays die, 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 die. and stays alive, not go to dead like some dead plants right okay so yeah we like to make sure it's a healthy plant what connor was trying to say and um other than that we normally we just oh. picked whatever one we wanted so as i said normally we just choose make sure it's you know it's a healthy plant and then we just we're choosing them based on the look basically like what we liked so now as I've gotten yeah. more into it, I've like researched Daddy. more things. I want to try to be more mindful of the plants that we choose Hi. based on you know, the, the obvious things. Now. Hold on. Let okay. me finish. Based on the obvious things, like how much light we have in the house, because we have one main room, which we're sitting in right now. This is our front room living area, and it has a big, pretty big set of windows. However, on that same side that has the windows, there is the air conditioning as well as the um as well as the radiator hug hug all right you gotta let me finish it has the ac as well as the um yep the radiator so you know i can't put things right up against the window so the wall behind me which is off to the side of the window and then this wall over that way which is directly across is where the majority of our plants yeah. are that so i just wanted to you know going forward be more mindful of the plants that i choose and that i have you know optimum dun, conditions dun, 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 for them to thrive dun, 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 dun. so flash forward to i looked up local nurseries and um, i always was a little hesitant about shopping there because for some reason i just felt like the plants would be higher priced and so i just always lean towards the big box stores because i know that i can get a pretty good plant for for 10 to 15 dollars um or you know even a lot less sometimes so i did a little quick google and i found this um local nursery in my area i think the woman there she was really nice um who was working at the time and she told me they're actually the only co-op um co-op plant nursery in the country i believe that's what she said don't quote me i will um post their their link if you were interested but it's really cool it is a co-op it's called urban roots and they have a huge section outdoors with basically anything you could need of course all different types of plants but they also have the products as well um everything from pots to stands to decor everything and then inside they have a selection of house plants and that's where my main focus was because i don't have an outdoor area um currently for plants so of course all of my plants are inside so i'm going to show a clip to you um, of me shopping around in there and then we will come back and i will show you a haul a haul of what i ended up getting so i'll see you back in a second
All right. I think those are glass, so you want to be careful. I did be careful with that one. <laughs> it looks like camping fire sticks. This looks like a fish thing. Hmm. I'm gonna find something. <gasps> they have the same one that we have. Yeah, we do have that one. Oh, OMG. I got something to show the kids. OMG. Oh, I think that's quite cool. Yeah, this one. Look, Mommy, look. Was there another one at home? Yeah, right there. Oh, okay. Oh, they're on the outside. Yeah. Wow, a turtle. Turtle. Mommy turtle. Turtle. Yes, that is cool. You like that? What's this for? Okay, let's not What's touch. This? Look with your eyes. Put that back. What is it? Because it's fragile stuff. I don't, I'm not sure what that is, but I don't want you picking stuff up. It's a disc. It's pretty pretty. Hmm. Well, we, we hmm. drive by down to the Wow! That's a very very special plant. I found very special plant that I'm showing to kids. That one. Showing it to the kids. That one right there. That one is called uh, I don't know. You go. You can find it out on the Would you like a copy of your receipt? Cool. Gorgeous! Come on, move back. Yeah. Come on. Mm -hmm. Okay, we'll be here. Whoa. We gotta roll the house go down for a nap. Okay. That works pretty much. Wow. I think these are the real airplanes over here. I have so much fun showing the kids this. Alright, we gotta carry that that plastic thing out. You can take the trays. Okay, yeah. Alright. I gotta show the kids something. I gotta show the kids this. All right, all right, all right, all right. Is this for his YouTube channel or your YouTube channel? <laughs> you having fun? Good. Are you all set? You still shopping? I'm, I'm all set. Okay. This is gorgeous. It's gorgeous. I was watching this one girl, and she wow. paid, she had like wow. one big leaf. And she said she paid $100. Oh, was it variegated? Yep, it was. Is that why? Yeah, people don't see any airplanes here. Don't see any. Yeah, no, don't see any. It's insane. But because they're so popular, mm -hmm. the growers can't keep them in stock, so they have to try to I don't see any. Oh, I'm looking. See. Don't see any. Hmm. All right, let Daddy turn it off. I know, I know, I know how to turn it on. Okay, guys, so we're back. Now, the first plant that I'm going to show you is my ultimate, ultimate... String <coughs> of pearls. Excuse me, yes, it's a string of pearls. And he definitely knows this name because, look at that, and it has blooms on it. Look at that. I'm so excited. It has some over there, too. Move that in closer so you can see. I'm so excited about this one. Ever since I first saw this one, I wanted it. Um, I think the first one I saw was actually fake, and I liked the look of it. So I was just like, okay, I have to have that. I really love it. And then when I found out it was called String of Pearls, I just thought that was even better. Yep. So I got this little guy here. He's still in the uh, planter, as you can see. I just put her in a cash pot. Um, I'm not going to repot it yet. But yeah, I was just so excited to find this. And I was happy to bring it home. It already has some, some length. It's starting to trail already. And I can definitely tell a difference even from it being home for the second day. So... I'm really excited about that. What do you want to say about String of Pearls? I know the name because it's stringy. Yes, it's stringy. It looks like pearls, yes. yes so this one I'm really pearls. excited about, and I can't wait to see what the blooms end up looking like because there are also, as you can see in top of there, 
There are also some buds that haven't opened up yet. So I'm just really excited to see how that one's going to turn out. And then, and some, and it's going to begin with flowers on them. Yep, it's going to get flowers. Let's sit that down gently. All right, we're almost done here because I only got two plants. And this one, which I am really, really excited about. I have seen this one in so many videos um, lately that I have watched. And I've just wanted one. This is the Palia. I believe I'm saying it correctly. And I'm just really excited about it. If you can see here in the middle, it has the one huge plant in the center. And then I counted around the side and it has four babies. So I got all of this together in the one pot. And I am going to propagate a couple of them because my niece wanted one. And then I want to just grow a little one myself from small. Hold on, please. So I am just really excited about that. I think it's so cute. This is another one. You can see like the little buds and everything right in there in the top. And this looks different even from when I brought it home as well. I can see it um, opening up and it's even sprouting more. So I feel like it's, um, it is adding really well to the apartment. Those are the two plants that I picked up from that local nursery. Again, it was called Urban Roots. I had a very good experience there. I would definitely go back. Um, what I found about the prices, um, my hesitation with the prices was definitely ease because it was very reasonable. There was a Monstera there that I want. That was like, would be the most I've ever put, paid for a plant. But my anniversary was coming up. I told my husband that's all I wanted was, you know, to, for him to get me that Monstera. So we'll see if he gets it. Um, I'll be very excited to have that. But I talked to her about the Monsteras too. And she said that, let me put this down. Because I don't want to about the Monsteras. And she told me they're so expensive right now because of them being so popular. The growers can't like you know keep up with the demand so they have to charge more for them or something to that effect she was saying and um she said that theirs were priced what they were because they already paid so much for them to begin with so i looked up and the price that it was was not anything too crazy compared to other places where i've seen them so it was pretty on par um if you liked it there and we will be going back so um, those are the two plans that we have for you today. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe so that you can see my growing houseplant collection um, Growing my channel based around that and me being a beginner and learning as I go and all of those great things Charlotte, please. <laughs> so if you would like to see more of our plant videos, please subscribe and we will see you next time. All right, crazy kids. Everybody say bye. Bye! bye.